All right, this is a game that I call Halloween Ghost Hunt. Okay, um, this is how I set up the gym. Okay, these right here are all cones, and these stars mark uh, students in relay formation. Um, the way this game works is I randomly hide a ghost underneath one of these cones. Now, I usually have about seven ghosts um, hidden under um, the cones randomly. So I usually have about 14 to 20 cones randomly spread out, kind of represented here. And then I have a ghost hiding under, um, hiding under them. Um, the way I make the ghosts is I have a plastic bag. I put a little koosh ball underneath it within the bag and I tie it with a rubber band and color a little ghost face on it. Yeah, make it more fun for the kids. This is a game that I play with a kindergarten, first and second grade students. I usually have the gym lights shut off um, and have kind of the security lights turned on so you can still see some light to add effect of Halloween. So on the signal, on the signal, the first person in the line runs and looks underneath one of the cones. Okay, they look underneath that cone, and um, if they find a ghost underneath there, they grab the, that ghost, and they run it all the way back to their team, put it behind their team, and then they obviously tag the next person in line, and then that person's turn to run and go hunt for a ghost. Now, If they're paying attention, obviously they would not go back to this cone here because there's no ghost, but they know, they don't know where the other ghosts are, so they keep going. Um, and then at the same time, the other teams are running and trying to find their ghost as well underneath those cones. Again, if there's no ghost underneath this cone, let's say this gray team here looked underneath this cone and there was no ghost there they cannot just go and look underneath one they have to go back to their team they have to return back to their team tag the next person and wait for their turn and it's just constant running back and forth very simple relay game and kind of a fun game to add some halloween effect to it uh, yeah i got this game uh from a former teacher of mine who has retired and I just kept it and add my own little twist to it. Anyway, um, there's this it for this game idea and uh, for further information, I'll have it on my blog.